going crazy like any mother would. Like, it was really fast. Like, I'm talking about real fast. A mother describes the terrifying moments when two teenagers jumped in her car and sped away with her two young children in the back seat. It's an interview exclusive to Eyewitness News. It happened Sunday night in the city of Chester at a takeout restaurant. Matt Petrillo is at Chester Police Headquarters with that exclusive interview and how the children are doing now. Matt? Well, Justin Yuki, the mother tells me her kids are doing fine. They were actually asleep at the time of the incident. The mother tells me that's partly why she didn't bring them with her inside the restaurant. She also says she's learned a lesson in all of this. I don't go nowhere without my kids. 28 year old Jasmine Barrett is a busy single mom of two boys who she's very protective of. She didn't want either of their faces shown for this story. Barrett also works as a nurse and says she had just gotten off a shift when she went to the Happy House Chinese restaurant here on the 900 block of West 9th Street in Chester around 930 Sunday night. I stopped to get my son some chicken and when I went in the store and paid for my food and came back out, I seen my truck driving down the street. Chester City Police say two suspects, both 17 years old, stole Barrett's vehicle with her nine-month-old baby boy and six-year-old boy still inside. I was going crazy like any mother would. A few hours after the vehicle was reported stolen, police found it just two blocks away in Chester with their two boys inside and unharmed. So why didn't Barrett take her boys with her when she picked up her food? They were asleep already. It's cold. That's a high drug area. I could have took them out. They could have been shooting now. And this why she had her kids out this time of night. Forget the fact that I'm a mother just getting off of work. Thaddeus Kirkland is the Chester City Mayor. Hopefully this will be a lesson learned not only by her but other parents. Because if it was that dangerous, you wouldn't have been in that place. Still, Barrett tells us she won't make the same mistake twice. I'm just happy I got my kids back and I'm thankful for the police. And she also tells us she's thankful for a woman who noticed her kids were by themselves and decided to call 911. Reporting live in Chester, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Okay, Matt, thank you.